The New York State Field Band Championships taking place this weekend with some local schools earning honors. Phoenix took home the Governor's Cup for the small school two division with East Syracuse Manoa coming in second. And Jordan Elbridge also got second place in the small school three division. News Channel 9's Kendra Brodus takes us to the JMA Wireless Dome. Instruments, costumes, and batons twirling through the air. Making up just a small part of the show put on at the JMA Wireless Dome Sunday. Well, you do try and focus on your own part, but you're really make sure, making sure you're watching the drum major, who's the one that's conducting. You're listening back to the battery, who's giving you the tempo and the rhythm. And you try and focus on your own part and you say, okay, where do I fit into that? And then once you, you find where your puzzle piece goes, everything just combines into that beautiful show. Regardless of what you know about the marching band, you can tell members like Ellinger are passionate about performing. I had a solo in the middle, and I love that little tiny solo. And then definitely at the end of part three, I go up and up and up the octave and just keep going up. It's so fun. I love the show. The last time ESM won the state championship was in 2017. Ellinger is proud of the way his team competed today and regardless of the outcome, is excited to take his talents to the next level. I'm definitely going to try and go to either DCA or DCI, which is drumming and brass for college. It's too, it sounds so fun. And they also they get to have a lot more fun. Each performance has a lot of moving parts. And in order for everyone's show to go on, someone has to man the big show. Chuck Penfield has been in the marching band community for decades, but this is his first time as show coordinator. This was always my favorite weekend when I taught it to. It's when the kids are their best, they're, they're all hyped, they're excited. It's a great time and it's, it's a bummer too because it's the last time. Each school had different themes, different sets, and different kinds of batons, but all of them share the same passion. At the JMA Wireless Dome, Kendra Brodus. <laughs> News Channel 9. All right, and the championship goes until 10 o'clock tonight. We'll update you on the outcomes for you at localsyr.com.